David Curtis, Team Professional here at the West of Mission Hills Golf Resort. Going to take you through changing your chip shot trajectory. And a very simple way that we can do this is just by changing the ball position in your stance. So we're going to take the same golf club and obviously a mechanic of a chip shot, the club head stays below your hands on both sides of the swing. So if we need some more help with that, there's a video uh, in my archives that can actually help you out with that. But just say, once again, a chip shot is mechanically done where the club head stays below the hands on both sides of the swing. So we get set up here to hit a lower chip shot. We're going to place the ball further back in our stance. Obviously my sternum is a little bit more forward of the golf ball. I always like to feel like I'm, a, I'm in front of the ball. I, I like to feel like I'm on the forward side of the ball in my setup. So as we make a chip shot, just with the ball back in the stance, go pretty low as you notice. Next time that we're going to do here, we're going to put the ball more middle of our stance and keep the same exact swing. We'll go a little bit higher. Now, the last one that we'll do, we'll put the ball a little bit more forward. Once again, same exact setup with my weight forward, okay? As I make a back swing, that ball flight's going to go a lot higher, okay? So ball position affects the loft of the golf club to help you change the trajectory of your golf ball. So practice this, and you'll have some really good ideas on how to get the ball lower, medium, and higher in your chipping. David Curtis signing off from Lessons.